This is our 1970 antelope and mule deer hunt in Wyoming. We hunted the antelope over around KC, Wyoming. There's a bunch of antelope and I told them guys of the book in there to start shooting well. Needless to say, they didn't hit anything. Nope, this is another time. That they, they ain't where they shot. This is later on. Yeah, you come down from that way, George. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah, must be looking over a few. See how big they are. We towed that truck out behind the motorhome. Somebody else has got the camera here. They're moving a little bit too fast, but that's all right. We're not professionals. Doc Morgan, Kenny Bennett, Elwood Robinson, George Stevens, myself, and my Uncle Steve. First trip I had my Uncle Steve on, he enjoyed it. Go after him, George. Oh my Savior, 
This is a country they call hole in the wall country there. Remember during history they call them hole in the wall gang? Well that's where they head out at. We're on, our, we're on our way now over to hunt some mule deer. Over near south of Evanston, Wyoming. South west corner. That's up at Yellowstone. We stopped there, refreshed itself a little bit, walked around, took some pictures, away we went. That's Jackson Hole, there's the ski slopes down there. Out in that country, the cattle have the right of way. Left Wyoming and going through Utah. Little patch of Utah we go through and then we go into Wyoming again. Now we're back in the hunting grounds. That's Kenny Bennett. Needles. I think that was one Doc Morgan shot. I guess Woody's going to wash his face off in the trough, nice and brisk. Lunch time, make your own sandwich. The mule deer wintered in this range down here and you might be there one day and there are not very many deer and the next day they're move in, they just keep moving into that country. That Steve shot that one, he ain't very happy with that. Smaller than he thought. Come on, Steve. <laughs> All right. Meat will taste good. That trick took a beating on that trip. 
Yep, got another one. That was our second trip to that country. The first trip we got some little bit bigger bucks than that, but these ain't bad. Oop, there's some deer. That was a nice country to hunt. You drive around the top of the hills and lots of times you spot some deer or even a patch of timber over there and you go drive it out. I think that's how we got that one. The boys drove from the top down and I think it was Elwood that killed that one. I guess maybe I'm supposed to say harvested anymore. They don't kill deer anymore, they harvest them. These are mostly little 15 minute clips of my hunts and I've added them out a little bit and did the best I could with them but they're not professional, we don't claim to be but just to show a little bit about what our hunts are all about. <laughs> 